Oh yeah, man, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, your host, Red Scott Dragon Squad. Bitch, back here with another reaction. Today we're here with Honest Trailers Wonder Woman. Um, probably my least favorite um, DCU movie, my favorite DCU movie, and the best one is Suicide Squad, my nigga. Some light. Uh, Wonder Woman, I mean, it was, it was cool, but I mean, it wasn't as hype as niggas was making it to be. Like, it was a war movie with Wonder Woman in it. That's all that was. That jink was trash. I'd rather watch motherfucking... Hmm, I'd rather watch this than Superman. The Man of Steel. So, I got that. But I would rather watch fucking... BVS than that. Hell yeah. I, I think I get a shit like a 5 out of... I think I get a shit a 4 or 5 out of 10. But anyway, we're gonna hop into this shit. Let's see what screen junkies gotta do. How they gonna roast them. You're two spectacles and let's run this hoe. You already know. You bumming. Today's episode is brought to you by M&M's Caramel Chocolate Candies. Mm. Let's get it. From the studio, known for confusing length with depth, complexity <laughs> with intelligence, and self-absorbed downers with heroism, the DCEU pulls off its biggest success yet by not doing those things. Mm -hmm. Wonder Woman. I guess, but Sosa Squad was still fire. After Supergirl, Catwoman, and Elektra, studios doubted a female-led superhero movie could succeed. Now, Patty Jenkins bravely asks the question, what if a female-led superhero movie wasn't absolute garbage from beginning to end? And I thought, I thought a Catwoman. powerful message for girls, save the world, look flawless doing it, be a literal god, then <laughs> men might begrudgingly have tolerate your presence. So, <laughs> if this woman can read it, we should hear what she has to say. Yes, very well. Woohoo! Progress! Settle <laughs> in for an origin story about the Greek gods. Inside an origin story for Wonder Woman. Inside an origin story for World War II. The armistice is wow. of paramount importance. And visit the Miscria. The Miscria. The Miscria. The, 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 the Visit Xena Warrior Island, a society of women trained from birth to cover for Gal Gadot's accent. In the events of an invasion, we belong to the greatest warrior in our history. You need to tell us now. Yes, but Ares is behind that corruption. These Amazons ah, true, have been true. preparing their whole lives to fight the god of war, Ares. Because I really and noticed it in the BPS. And when war reaches their shores, they'll get wrecked by German teams with bolt action rifles. Exactly. Hell no. Maybe send out a scout once every 500 years, or at least deploy some of your invisible jets. I know you have them. Yeah. Meet Diana, a girl never actually referred to as Wonder Woman. She's the hero that True. DCEU doesn't deserve, but sure as hell needs right now. She's optimistic, confident, iron-willed, vulnerable, uncompromising, and just so hot. Oh my god. Steve right. was like... <laughs> I mean, I don't want to come off like James Cameron, because it's definitely not the only thing she's got going for, but damn. Mm. She's stronger, faster, and smarter than the men around her. But every superhero has a kryptonite, and hers is not knowing jack about anything. War. Uh. What war? It's a watch, tells time. What for? Why are they holding hands? It's what do <laughs> these women wear into battle? Does the average man not sleep? What is a secretary? Yeah, she front? has too many questions. Wait, front of what? Marriage? That was what made it annoying. 100 languages. You know what marriage means. Experience exactly. It's this groundbreaking superhero movie. But not so groundbreaking that they didn't put one of the bankable Hollywood Chris's in it. Chris Pine surprises and delights in a performance that gives him his first lead in the great Hollywood Chris off. Wow. But really? he's more than just eye candy. He's Diana's emotional support, a voice of caution, and a love interest in constant need of rescue. Uh -huh. Hey, they gave him the role women always have to play against the male superheroes, didn't they? Ah. Uh -huh. That's what you did there. In a film with two grounded, complex leads, cringe at villains pulled from a different, much campier movie. But the mask uh, won't help. They don't know that. <laughs> that seems to forget the Germans in World War I were not the Nazis. One of the good guys, and those are the bad guys. Seriously expects us to buy this human milk thistle as the god of war, and implies that Wonder Woman kept yeah. her head down for all of Hitler and Stalin. <laughs> but did suit up the moment Lex Luthor made a Ninja Turtle. Ah, uh, you know true. I'm sorry for even bringing BBS into this. Let's just let this one stand on its own. 
So get ready for a film about balancing the good and bad in all of us that contains good and bad within itself in this flawed but important movie that's no less important for having flaws. Is it an inspirational, well-made film that finally gives women a superhero to be proud of? Yes. Does it end with the Lightning Hands Mustache Man yelling video game level dialogue? And I believe in love. Then I will destroy you! Also yes. Starring Amazon Prime. Wow. Want to touch the piney. Also the queen and gladiator. Princess Cutterup. Oh, party boy. Would you, uh, uh, mm, uh, oh, hmm. uh, apologies. A drunk Scotsman. A sneaky oh. Frenchman. A wise old Indian guide. Yeah. What are these guys? The Howland stereotypes? Pam Beasley. I, I mean, Don Tinsley. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, and shit. Snyder Vision. A Snyder Justice Vision. League of her own. <laughs> true, true. Maybe you're better off without me, yeah? No, Charlie. Wrong thing for us. Um, your friend clearly has PTSD. Don't go in there! Let him go home. This motherfucker. Thanks again to Eminem's caramel chocolate candies. Okay, for you can't shoot a damn episode. thing, bro. Could this voice be any more epic? I've written so many comments, but none of them have made it. Hey, no, you're an all star. I'm Penny. Hey, now, could be hey, now. Clone. B A B Y, baby. Mm -hmm. Well, man, it's gonna wrap it up for that, man. Um, that shit was funny, man. Screen junkie always be spot on with this stuff, bro. For real, for real, man. Um, I don't even know what my funniest, jo my favorite joke was. I don't know, man. But that joke was lit as always, man. Um, can't wait for the next one. I wonder what the next one gonna be. Um, can't wait for fucking Justice League to come out so to prove all you fuck niggas wrong. DC is superior to Marvel movies. I mean, well, DC is superior to Marvel. They're, they're not superior to Marvel movies. No, I don't know, I don't know about that, coach. That uh, Captain America Civil War was like that. But um, y'all guys can post your comments down below. Tell me what you guys thought about this, man. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Dislike if you didn't. Subscribe. I upload every single day except for on Fridays. And I'm me all this bitch dragon squad. Bitch! Suicide so Squad is the best DCEU film, nigga. Yeah, I said it that way. Dexter, huh? Yeah. I know. Then my ex, you know that I moved on and you kind of played on my ass and I understand cause love is a curse and a hash. Baby, I love fucking you and you love the sex. Why you act like you?